everybody welcome back to the channel glad you tuned in man we got a nice quick ride to Leesburg bike fest today so I'm gonna meet up some friends over here at cafe 27 and then we're gonna take off right on US 27 and go up north so we're gonna come in here real quick to cafe 27 and park and see who's here uh, and Wait to see what happens, man. We're gonna catch everybody leaving here. We're gonna come to the back. Like I said, we'll be in the back of the pack, Oldie and I. We're getting just a little bit of rain from this cloud right here. Don't expect a lot of rain. We're uh at about a 5% chance, I think, or 5 to 10%, I think. So we shouldn't get a lot of rain. Out of this whole group, everybody's staying in a different hotel. Uh, Oldie and I are sharing a, a room. And we're gonna be like uh, 24 minutes south of Leesburg, of downtown Leesburg. this crop duster out guys on the camera it probably looks far away but it is super close man now, I didn't catch it but when it was coming this way it got so close to those power lines man kind of scary to watch in case you didn't know and this little area right here is the richest soil if you haven't seen my previous videos on this area but um, if you want to know where you're getting most of your sugar from, it's right here. So Lake Okeechobee is right over this mound right here. That's actually a levee sitting right next to the lake. So we're riding through the town of Clewiston right now. Uh, we're still next to Lake Okeechobee. This is a humongous lake, so it's you know it runs for quite a few miles. before we stop for gas and uh, we keep going out but I'm looking forward to a little stretch this is Sebring Florida and we play we passed uh, Lake Placid this part of Florida is a little more hilly than South Florida so it's uh, it's a little more scenic you see the big lakes here you get a quick lunch at this restaurant here uh, to one of the couples up there wants to eat so we're gonna stop and eat all gassed up, ready to go. We got about two hours or so to go. So we're actually at uh, Gator Harley Davidson, part of Leesburg Bike Fest. Alright, 
baby Main Street we have arrived more bikes packed into this little space here this little street than you see at, uh, at bike week right as they let you park them here in the middle and on the uh, on the sides of the street so that's pretty cool because you get to see all the bikes as you're riding by Sir.
chilling out. Daytona for saying this, but everybody out there in the YouTube world knows Leesburg, much better bike show, man. Much better bike fest, friendlier people, right? Friendlier cops, you name it. It's all here, man. They got great entertainment. The food is better. I don't know. You guys tell me you've been here. Comment. Let me know what's up. get me bro listen up guys I keep talking with everybody and I keep saying this but I'm kind of done with the bike fests for a little bit now I know you know bike week we got a ride over there uh, Trey B and I from ripping on two but like the bike fest itself man I don't know call me old call me I don't know some something, something's just not clicking there anymore so I don't know comment down below let me let me know what you guys think what do you what do you think about that like I, I just want to get back to my ride and going to destinations and doing stuff and visiting places I haven't been uh, yeah I'm, I think I'm gonna get back to that anyway we're out of here man we're uh, we came we saw we conquered and we're gonna come back to the hotel hang out for a bit and uh, I don't know shoot the breeze for a little bit and then uh, Tomorrow morning, get up, have breakfast, and the ride back. But we're taking the turnpike because that was rough. Look, man, right now we're trying to find a place just to chill. Oldie will probably have a little drink. I'm going to have some tea and crumpets. <laughs> <laughs> yeah baby I gave up the sauce I gave it up man I don't know if you all know that I don't know if I ever told you that but about a year less than a year and a half ago I gave up the sauce there's no more drinking no more drinking for Manny it's all good man Cause I still have fun anyway, bro. Oof, good morning, man. What a beautiful morning. 
this is the weather we got to ride back but we got to get some breakfast man we're gonna go over here to the uh, nearest first watch just checked out it's 9 30 in the morning fueling up because you know you can't move one of these things without fuel right just saying Right now I'm at uh, 24,630 miles. So yeah, I forgot if it was 640 or 660 that I have to break it in, but I'll uh, I'll make sure I'm still varying the throttle and keeping it under 3K up to the 660. Should be all right after that. What's up, y'all? Yeah, we're officially uh, broken in. kind of gradually take it up but yeah it's sputtering a little bit at 3k it's uh it's in dire need of a good two 79 80 miles per hour on um, just under 3k all right watch this all right there it's sputtering and uh, it's hard to tell on camera but kind of losing power right when I hit 3k and go a little bit above so I'm not gonna push it all right y'all we're at the halfway point we're gonna stop here at the Port St. Lucie Fort Pierce service plaza off the turnpike and stretch our legs use the bathroom and fill up and that's the only stop we're making Don't forget to hit that like because if you don't it doesn't stay up on YouTube circulating much so any help you can give would be appreciated as always love you guys to death stay safe on the road man see y'all soon peace